At the Cabernet Law Courts, the hour of judgment had come. The offenders having to bear the embarrassment of listening as the said offences committed in secrecy were read out loud and clear for all to hear and translated into Kiswahili to so that no one was left out. He had gone to the grandmother's house, he moved his clothes as if he had reached his house and raped her and raped the helpless grandmother. That was in reference to 19-year-old Samuel Kikechem. The prosecutor proved beyond reasonable doubt that he raped his own 90-year-old grandmother. The accused can be stated to be a first offender, but he will serve as an example to the society. I, I will desire that he comes out of prison one day to tell the others the consequences of the state offense. Otherwise, the principal magistrate wouldn't have hesitated to sentence Kikechem to life in prison because he believes the offender deserved it. The accused will thus serve 40 years imprisonment so that he, when, he comes, he will, when he comes out, it will be mature enough in order to live among other people. Once he was escorted away to begin a new chapter of life behind bars, another man replaced him at the dock. This time it was a man who the magistrate found guilty of committing incest against his seven-year-old daughter. For his own motive and his own service interest, the accused had taken the child away to his home. And uh, he had continued to rape her, uh, to divide her because that was a norm with him. The matter apparently came to light when a prosecution witness inquired from the child why the father had taken her away. The he had disclosed that the father was taking her away so that she can use her as a wife. We have distorted the image of this man in order to protect the identity of the child he's guilty of defiling. It is sad that the minor here could not stand the presence of the father as he testified because of the pain either for, for petroleum by a person that she adored. The court found that the prosecution had equally proved their case beyond reasonable doubt. And uh, I will pronounce rave imprisonment for the said offence. The two men, both guilty of crimes of incest, have 14 days to appeal their respective sentences. Sylvie Chabet, Citizen Live at Nine.